A lot of people look good in real life but their pictures come out bad. Because you're just not photogenic. It happens to a lot of people. In converting a 3D image like a person into a 2D image like a photo. Some features are lost. We see in 3D because we have two eyes. And a camera has one eye that can only see in 2D so it doesn't get your facial features correct. Sometimes the camera literally flips the photo. Like a mirror. If you look beautiful in the mirror you're most likely very beautiful. Cameras distort reality. Usually in subtle ways. But people who take lots of portrait shots will tell you that posture can make a world of difference. Not because it changes the way you look in person. But because it strongly affects the way you show up on camera. I think some people instinctively have good camera posture. And it does a lot for them. I'm even aware of extreme cases of people who look good in pictures even though they're not particularly attractive. That's why a lot of models look very attractive in photos. But in real life. They look like normal people. So don't get depressed about your looks just because you don't look good enough in photos. Don't be too critical of yourself. A camera never captures your beauty but other people will. I do professional photography, and some people are better at taking pictures. That doesn't mean they are better looking or anything like that. They probably have just taken a lot of pictures so they have a better concept of how they should pose and hold themselves. Other people don't because they probably don't take a lot of pictures. People always like to make fun of people who take the same picture dozens of times to get the perfect one but those people are the ones who get practice at posing and positioning themselves. When I do a photo shoot I might take 50 or more snaps of the same pose, slightly different angles, and adjustments to try and find one that will look good. Some people I only need a couple before I get one that's just right. It takes practice and if you feel like you don't look good in pictures it means you need to take more. Try different angles. Hold the camera closer or farther away. The focal length on different lenses can stretch your face in weird ways sometimes. Also this other thing. I don't know whether this happens with you guys or not but earlier when I used to see my photos. I thought I looked worse than what I thought I looked like. I was used to seeing myself standing in front of the mirror so the mirror me was better looking than myself in photos or so as I thought. When you look at yourself in the mirror everything looks perfect about you your smile, teeth, hair. You subconsciously build an image of what you look like. But when you notice the differences, it feels bad. If you struggle to like your appearance in photos, there are a couple of tricks that I've recently learned. First, figure out which is your better side. Always take pics from that side. Turn your ear slightly to the camera. Same ear as your good side. Most people look a little better from above. So if you're not having your entire body photographed, and the photographer is your height or shorter, Bend your knees slightly so the photographer is higher than you. Tilt your chin slightly up. If you have a double chin, push your chin out and then slightly up. The camera won't know, and the photos will appear with a stronger jawline. For full body photos, keep your shoulders straight ahead, but turn your hips to the side, and put one leg in front of the other. Also, look up tips on YouTube. I was amazed at how much better my photos were. This is absolutely true. I've heard it compared to how when you take a photograph of the moon or of a sunset, it usually looks terrible. But what you were actually seeing with your eyes was beautiful. The camera just can't capture it. I applied this to a friend. I never told her because it would be hurtful to say she looks bad in photos. But I used to think that she might have a really skewed view of herself because in truth she is 100x more beautiful in person than in photos. But she probably sees photos of herself and thinks that's just how she looks. I remember the first time I saw a photo of her, I already knew her. But when I saw the photo I thought damn that didn't capture her well. But then that became a theme, in 90% of her photos, she looked not so good. I remember me and her were hanging out with some friends, and my friend brought up this phenomenon. He said some people just have this air about them. A beauty that shines from their aura. But it cannot be photographed. 